Welcome back to Toucan Plays Monster Jam Steel Titans 2. I'm driving around here with my blue thunder truck, just kind of hanging out in Camp Crushmore. This is what I'm going to do. I am going to start the Career Mode Plus. I'm so excited about it. I'm happy to be back in Monster Jam Steel Titans 2 again, you know? like It's just a fun game. Let's get into it, though. So we're going to do World Career Mode Plus, higher difficulty and higher XP rewards. I would do it on a hard, but my trucks just are not leveled up enough yet. Um, it's, it's just medium is just hard enough. Until I can get my trucks leveled up, I'm going to have to stick with medium. Okay, so we're in Salt Lake City, and it looks like our first contender is going to be Zombie. <laughs> I know you can't see me because I've got my camera off, but I'm doing the zombie arms. Blue Thunder is such a cool truck. I love it. Yeah, so Salt Lake City, it's just a big circle. But I have to stay tight in. I have to make sure I'm making tight, tight circles. Even on medium, because just because my trucks are not leveled up yet. And we're also playing without the HUD, the heads up display, so I cannot see how fast I'm going, where I'm at on the map. Just to add that little bit of extra difficulty. And so I have no idea if I've won or not. I think I did though. Yep, just barely though. My gosh, less than a second between me and zombie. Okay, next up, Monster Mutt Rottweiler. So cool. I love that truck. I can't wait till I get to the Monster Mutts. You know, not that Blue Thunder's not a cool truck. He absolutely is. In fact, he's a cool truck, not just in the game, but in real life. I just recently saw some video footage of Blue Thunder doing this not quite a cartwheel, but he was doing a bicycle, and then he went from the bicycle to a stoppy to a moonwalk, and it was the most ridiculous thing. Maybe I'll splice it into the video here. Nice! But that was just this last weekend in Arlington. Texas. Okay, got Monster Mutt Rottweiler, and looks like next up is going to be Blue Thunder versus Blue Thunder. May the best Blue Thunder win. <laughs> so, what I need to do for each chapter, I don't know. I'm sure that if you play Monster Jam Steel Titans 2, you know that each chapter has a little triangle on it. You get that triangle by finishing first in the series overall. So my goal is to go through the career mode plus and get a triangle first place for every event. And I also, you know, I just want to level up all the trucks, you know, and I'm, and I'm going to level up all the trucks. I'm going to post those videos here. Maybe I'll do those in lives, live streams, just leveling up. I think that'd be fun. Nice. So we won. I was the best Blue Thunder. Hey, do me a favor. If you're enjoying this series and you want to see more Monster Jam Steel Titans 2, smash that like button. It really does help these videos get out to more people. Helps me to know I'm doing a good job and that you want to see more videos. I really do appreciate it. With that, let's get moving into our freestyle event. Nice, big air and sky wheelie. I love it. I'm just going to go around collecting these beacons. So get another big air. Oh, yes. And I love the sky wheelie. Oh, no. <laughs> I kind of came down a little hard. And get back up. There we go. I love this game because you could do like the craziest stunts in this game. And it just doesn't matter. You know, I love Beeman G2, but Beeman G, if you did any of this kind of crazy stuff, oh, let's do a moonwalk. Yes, there we go. Good stoppy and get a moonwalk in there. Nice. There we go. 
if you did any of these crazy things in, in BMNG, your car would be dead. Okay, let's do a backflip, but let's do a backwards. A backwards backflip. A reverse backflip. Let's see. Come on. Oh, come on. Man, I was playing around in BMNG and I tried doing a, a reverse backflip like that and I couldn't. Couldn't do it there either. These games just aren't programmed for that kind of stuff. I don't know. Maybe in Monster Chuck Championship I can do that kind of stuff. I don't know. Maybe. That seems to be more of a simulation type game. I think I'll give it a shot. Oh, our timer's almost up, I'm sure. Nice bicycle. I've only got a couple more of these beacons. Yeah, okay, timer's almost up. Oh, come on, get up, get up, get up. Let's finish it off with a good donut and a cyclone, shall we? That's a good way to wrap things up. Yes. Man, I, I have no body left. I'm completely naked. That's funny. Oh, let's see. Maybe we can come over here and catch this last beacon. Got it. Oh, that wasn't in time, though. That's okay. Got a level up for Blue Thunder. Still got first place in that event and first place overall in all of the standings. Time for our last event, Range Roven. It's a waypoint race. Here we go. Oh man, this brings back some memories of my very first video I ever posted to YouTube. It was this event. I think I've come a long way both as a content creator and as a Monster Jam player. Oh, come on. I say as I almost wipe out. <laughs> But you know what? I'm still way ahead of everybody else. And that was playing on easy. And they were still right on my tail before. Whereas now I am wiping the floor with them. I remember I shot way up there where those little A-frame houses are. That's not where I need to go. <laughs> that was fun. I've, I've enjoyed this YouTube journey so far. I'm going to keep doing it. And just like my YouTube journey... I have found success with that map. <laughs> first place on that waypoint mission and first place in the standings, which means we've unlocked Blue Thunder <laughs> yet again. All right, just as a reminder of where Blue Thunder's open world co hidden collectible is, it's right here at the top of the map. You just kind of drive on up here. Be sure to check out the, the video that you see up in the top right corner of the screen. That is my ultimate guide to Camp Crushmore. That's got all of this vehicle's open world hidden collectibles. I just love Blue Thunders though. Like that lightning coming down, the thunder crashing. So cool. Blue Thunder looks awesome too. There we go. That is Blue Thunder's Hidden World Collectible. And that is going to do it for this episode. Thank you all for joining me. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you haven't done so already. Hit the notification bell so that you never miss an upload. And we'll see you on the flip side. Later.